Contributing to the sinking was the Coast Guard's failure to require sufficient reserve buoyancy in amphibious vessels. Contributing to the loss of life was the Coast Guard's ineffective action to address emergency in egress on amphibious passenger vessels with fixed canopies, such as the Stretch Duck 7, which impeded passenger escape. This accident didn't occur just that day in Branson, Missouri. This accident and this tragedy occurred because the duck boat industry has ignored warnings for decades that their canopies trap and cage passengers, drown them and kill them. Uh, I think that any duck boat captain on any of the duck boats that are left uh, is setting themselves up uh, to go to prison uh, if they take a duck boat out onto the water that has a fixed canopy on it. Uh, it. The message has been crystal clear from the NTSB. You don't have sufficient reserve buoyancy. If you can't remain afloat, those canopies are death traps.